girlfriend's fucking sister-in-law in Cambo. We're sharing a fucking caravan. So there's fucking four birth caravan and there's fucking six of us in it. But anyway, you gotta fucking live somewhere and I'm pretty happy with that. So to get me a fucking off the dole, I'm trying to fucking help out me mate and do some beer reviews. He's given me He's giving me these beers. These are fucking called Stubby. They're a Kolsch. Whatever the fuck that is. It's fucking German for fucking something. But anyway, it's fucking Kolsch. It's fucking 4.4%. In a fucking little tiny fucking bottle. Looks like a fucking medicine bottle. Let me get one out and show you. Look at that little beauty. Like, that's what a beer should come like. Something like that, shouldn't it? Fucking great. A lot of us are gonna fucking put this in a glass. It's just fucking needs to be drunk straight out of this fucking bottle. Yep, yeah, fucking smells like fucking beer. Well, fucking stubby. They're made fucking for Woolworths. They're made by Woolworths by the pinnacle fucking something or other. But it's made in fucking Perth. Place near Frio called Palomai. Palomar, Palomino, Palomino, Palomar, Pala, Palomar, Pala, Pala, Pala. Anyway, it's made in fucking Perth. So they make it in Perth, they ship it out to fucking all the woolies, and then I found it in Uncle fucking Dan's. And if, if you're an Uncle fucking Dan's member for a fucking 24, $38.50. Fucking fuck it when you're on the fucking doll. So, anyway, what do they say? They say it's Australian made, it's homegrown hops and malt. Stubby, 4.4% in a little fucking 330ml beautiful looking stubby bottle. Get one of them up ya. Yeah. Uh, where's me fucking mate? Is it, what does it say? Uh, this is off fucking app called Drinks Trade. They say the stubby is back, it's his five of the days when shorts were shorts and mullets were long. Back at mullets, go to the back of mullets. And taste how an Aussie beer should, smooth, balanced and stubbornly refreshing. If you're more into beer than your beer, then stubby is the beer for you. So, they've got a straw gold in colour, which you can't fucking see because I'm not going to put it in glass because it doesn't deserve it. Stubby features a tasty combination of lifted floral and savoury herbal with a classic hop character. Topaz hops provide a clove-like spiciness and a light and lychee tropical fruitness that ends with a clean bit of finish. Alright, well I'll be the fucking judge of that. So, let's get a fucking into us. Fucking jeez, you fucking losers. Yeah, well, it's got a fucking beer taste to it. It is a bit fucking herby. It tastes very herbal. So, I don't know what that is, whether it's... They say it's clove. Clove is like a piece of fucking grass, isn't it, that you find in your lawn. And if you're lucky, you might get a full clove leaf. But I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, that's what they say. But it does taste a bit herby. Um... To me, it's a bit rosemary. It's a mm, bit rosemary. Look, it's pretty easy to fucking drink. It's pretty fat refreshing, because they say it is fat refreshing. 
Mate, I reckon you can fucking slam fucking this whole cart down on a fucking hot summer's day. But seeing as though we're at the end of fucking autumn, going into winter, you might only want to smash six of them and then get into the fucking jimmies. The fucking jimmies. So, anyway, I'll give it a rating. It's not bad. It's pretty good, I reckon, for price and for fucking flavour and drinkability. I'll give it... I'm going to give it... I'm going to give it a 3.0112. So, 3.20. Anyway, cheers. It's a fucking send it as usual. Let's fucking see if we can send this fucking little bar down. And go on, better get, get your fucking lives in the water, fucking pair of your fucking losers. Oh, 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 what do I say? It's all good. Cheers.